Good evening, guys and dolls, cats and kittens. I hope you all are doing well out there, taking care of yourselves, taking care of your homes, staying nice and healthy, keeping your home smelling good, looking good. And with that being said, today's um, session is going to be about keeping yourself organized with storage tips for efficient cleaning. Um, when I was a hotel cleaner, when I first moved up to the mountains, you know, you had your little cleaning bucket, your little cleaning cat of your bucket there, and you'd go around and you get all your little supplies that you need, grab a couple of toilet papers, some extra rags, and off you go, because you don't want to go back to the main area any more than you have to, because time is money, costs you time, the more rooms you get done, you know, the better off you're doing, the faster you can get out of there. Same thing with your home, time is money, organization is everything, and so I'm going to give you a few tips here on how to stay organized, being efficient with your space so that you can get all your cleaning utility items together, have it all in one place, grab what you need, be on your way, hit the house, Go back, put your clean your stuff if you need to, put it away again. Um, utility items are usually relegated to the garage and fit neatly inside a cleaning closet if they can be collapsed flat for storage. Um, I don't have a cleaning closet. I have a cleaning underneath my sink area that I hold everything in. And I have two big buckets where I try to get every, our storage units where you can kind of pull it in and push it out to keep all my storage things in. And the uh, uh, mop things and stuff I keep behind my trash can because of my space. I do want to um, put the little things there where you can hang them up against the wall. Uh, find what you need at a glance with clear storage rack bins, uh, which is fine. But I kind of, like I said, use mine like this. I just pull them out and look into it like that because of the way my storage area space is set up. Um, Half the battle of cleaning day is gathering the right supplies for the job, uh, keeping your life organized makes your life e easier. Um, a collapsible bucket is a good idea. The floor cleaner in one space, locating a cleaning closet near a sink minimizes steps if you can. That's why mine's in my kitchen underneath my sink. Handy cleaning schedule to keep home maintenance on track. Create your own custom cleaning schedule and tack it inside the cabinet door. Include weekly, monthly, quarterly, and yearly chores. Make notes about special seasonal tasks needed or homemade cleaning solution recipes on a dry erase sheet mounted next to the schedule. So I guess with me, I could put it on the inside of my door like magneted on there. That would be good. I think that's such a cool idea because um, I always have track of remembering when I did the last thing I did. That's just so organizationally good. Free up valuable space, junk door space with effortless organization idea. Install dividers inside of drawers of a small cabinet and then sort frequently needed items like office supplies, batteries, and storage postage stamps into each space. Add labels and swap them out as contents change. Top shelf cleaning supplies. Store large lightweight items such as empty buckets and empty paper towels and extra paper towels on high shelves. If you need, oh, I guess that's where that collapsible bucket would come in. So good. If you need a step stool to reach these items, it will be easier to handle than heavier objects. That way you're not dropping things on your head, which is what I always do, cracking my head open. This clears up floor space and allows you to keep items you use regularly at eye level. Paper towel organizer. Mount a paper towel holder towards the top of the inside of the door for a quick access. After grabbing your cleaner or choice of cleaners, you can easily tear off what you need to get to work. Stock extra paper towels nearby so you can replace the roll easily. I'm kind of like a rag person, so I would just, you know, not need that many paper towels. Make a kit of frequently used supplies that can be carried around the house, stocking the cleaning caddy or bin according to a specific task, such as microfiber, dusting cloths, furniture polish. With everything in one place, you won't have to make multiple trips to your closet. Behind the door storage closet cleaning. 
the behind the door cleaning closet storage. The back of the cleaning closet door reveals valuable vertical storage space to put it to use by hanging a clamp style rack for brooms and mops. That's what I want to get, but I don't have it be on my kitchen wall by the, the trash can there. Cleaning closet hooks. Install small coat hip. Well, I don't know. I don't know why I can't talk now. Install small coat hooks on the side of your closet to hang a duster broom and dust pan. Keep pairs of rubber gloves together by clipping them with a binder clip and hanging them from another wall.